Hey, how's it going, guys? Today, Bungie released their newest and latest version of the developer roadmap on the website, and they essentially made one big change for the May update. Nothing really changed for the March 27th update from what I can tell, but the new change for May is the Heroic Strike modifiers are going to be coming in that update as opposed to this update. They say it was because they found a problem late in development that required them to push it back, so that's why we're going to be getting it in May. Bungie also showed us the first six rotations of the new Weekly Crucible playlist, and it's going to go as follows. March 27th, the day the update comes out, we're going to get Rumble. April 3rd, the following week, we're going to have Mayhem. April 10th, Iron Banner. April 17th, Rumble again. April 24th, Mayhem again. May 1st, Iron Banner again. So from the looks of this, it seems like we're going to get Iron Banner once every third rotation, which means that all the other playlists are going to have to fight for those first two slots. And the problem I see here is that Rumble is on this list, meaning that Rumble is going to be locked away potentially for more than a month or even two months at best because they've already confirmed that Doubles is returning and they've also alluded to other playlists in the future. They haven't really given specifics just yet, but having noticed their patterns recently, I can pretty much infer they're going to be bringing back all of the playlists from D1 and possibly adding in new ones. So if I'm correct, that means that those first two rotations are going to be split amongst possibly five or more playlists, which means that after you play Rumble, for example, you might not get to play it again for two whole months, which I feel is unacceptable. Rumble is the only playlist where a Guardian truly makes their own fate. Probably the biggest pain in my ass in the Crucible right now, and pretty much since D2 even started, is dealing with stacked teams. It happens to me practically all day, even in quick play. This is the game mode where people aren't supposed to be not sweaty, and it's still kind of sweaty sometimes. And it's kind of frustrating. And the second biggest pain in my ass is being shoulder charged or bumped off of heavy so that my own teammate can go and steal it and die five seconds later. Granted, on the 27th, that's going to be changing a little bit because when they do die, I'm going to grab their heavy, dance, and then keep it moving. However, I feel like in Rumble, at the very least, I don't have to deal with any of that. It's all on me, win or lose, it's all because of what I did in that game. For that reason, they should make Rumble available at all times, as its own separate playlist. If you agree with what I just said, then I want you to write in the comment section, Guardians make their own fate. If you're on Anchor, you can still write a comment. If you're on iTunes, Google Play, or anywhere else, then just hit the subscribe button so you don't miss a single episode, and I'll see you guys on my next live stream or my next video or podcast.